everybody. Welcome to Cooking with the Lotto King. We are making the best ever potato soup. Uh, this recipe is courtesy of tasteofhome.com, which you can find it over there if you are looking for the recipe. I'm not going to give exact ingredients, and I kind of cheat the system a little bit. Uh, I used to make these back when I was a kid. My mom used to make these bad boys. Hello, Scratch and Princess. Good afternoon to you. Almost evening, I guess, for you. Hello to everybody else who's watching. We have five people watching. Hello, Robert. Yes, we're making bacon. We're doing a joint effort on the bacon. Um, I'm currently doing some in the pan. I'm getting in the pan, and I also have some in the air fryer. So I'm kind of half air frying and half pan frying. So, Hello, Sharon. Hello. Good morning, everybody. Afternoon. I guess it's afternoon. I'm just trying to get my life back together here after being away for just one day. Um, but it's been crazy. Bacon makes this recipe. Just trust me, we got bacon, there's cheese, there's a shh, too many onions. We've got chicken broth over here, we've got potatoes. All of this has already been prepped, so I don't have to make a fool out of myself. Hey, good evening, darling Ping. Hello, sir. Alright, so. I think we're gonna take, we'll let that air fry just a little bit longer until it cycles complete, and then I think we're just gonna throw it in the pan. We'll have to deal with a little bit of drippings, but. So basically, we're gonna start with some bacon in the pan. Hello, Sufak. We're gonna use some bacon in the pan. This is apple and smoked bacon. Again, I was gonna air fry it all, but I ran short on time. I started prepping around 11.30 and then I ran out of time. So we're making the best ever potato soup, um, according to tasteofhome.com. They say it's the best ever. Me and my mom used to make this when I was a kid, and it's really good. You put bacon and cheese in it, and it's just, it's really simple too. It's not that crazy. Um, I sometimes add a couple things to it, like I'll add hot dogs to it. We used to call it penny and potato soup. And hey, good morning, Matt. I was just watching Wicked Penny. I don't know if she is still alive, but she was making some good flatbreads this morning. If you don't know Wicked Penny, go look her up and subscribe to her. She is freaking hilarious. And she's cooking. She was cooking and baking this morning. So I was trying to wait for her to be done before I went live. You know, they're going so many cooking channels on YouTube at the same time. So. This bacon's looking yummy. We think we're gonna take our air fried bacon. We are. We're gonna take what was being air fried. Add all that grease in there for yumminess. Um, her name is Wicked Penny. Look her up. She does casinos and slots and um, We'll put all that grease in there for the time being. We might eventually um, drain that out before we start <laughs> all our stuff, but we're gonna let all the boys in the pot cook right there. We're just gonna let those go a little bit. Yeah, hopefully everyone is well. I'm back from Boston. I got back last night about 10.30, give or take. I was in bed by 11, up at seven, went for breakfast, went to the bank, and I'm cooking. Hello, T, how are you? I got a busy day today, but I'm like, we still have to cook. So we're gonna get all my meal prep done. I'm actually gonna have a bowl of this when we're done because it's gonna kind of be my snack lunch. I'm still gonna go get pizza later, but you're just a snack. And then tomorrow I'm going to meet up with an old classmate who I haven't seen in years for lunch. So. Hello, Stacy. Hello, scratch me off. Beware, I just cooked bacon in the fryer, so you might want to clean that bad boy out before you do yours. Unless you're okay with bacon. <laughs> oh, fucking the vegetarians, look how my god this. Did, what'd you say? Did you get candles from BBW? What is that? I don't think so. Is that big, big, beautiful woman? Yeah. Oh, hello, Wesley. I have not gotten any candles from any big, beautiful woman. I'm assuming that's something else, but. But you've gotten some BBW. Yeah, Bath and Body Works. Oh, no, I did not. I saw that they were on sale. I have not been to a Bath and Body Works or ordered online. I don't usually buy from there, but I saw they have some good deals. So, $8.95 candles today only. Ooh. Hello, Jersey Scratcher. How are you doing on this Saturday? Yeah, we're definitely going to drain some of this bacon grease out of here before we add all of our other ingredients to this soup because that's a lot of bacon grease. It's never bad to cook with it. Yeah, actually, the bacon grease might actually add some flavoring to the soup. I don't know if I've ever drained it before. Usually I use pre-cooked bacon, so you all should be proud of me. This is real, this is applewood smoked bacon. We're just gonna get these guys a little bit more done. We're making potato soup. We are, but we're making the best ever potato soup. It's best ever. Yeah, 
it is, it is more bacon. I had a bacon, egg, and cheese omelet for lunch. Uh, so the deal is, everyone, if you haven't heard, the Lotto King has gained 11 pounds on his trial. The Lotto King is getting fat, everybody. So don't fat shame me. Josh has been fat shaming me all day yesterday on Facebook. It hurts my feelings. It's not my fault. It's all part of the drug. My ankles have some edema to them, so it's crazy. I know, it's the obese Lotto King. Probably by the like the bass the bass body index scale or whatever that is, I'm sure I am obese. Alright, so get that bacon just a little bit longer. So hopefully everyone's doing good. If you've been gambling, hopefully you're winning. Uh, we're gonna do some tickets tonight. I got some bankroll. Um, I did play $40. I ended up, I posted that video from Harrisburg. I actually did buy an, I finished out the role of Chris Kringle and I only found one $5 winner at the end. So I do have a whole $10 to add to that, but. He said the wrong, oh geez. The obese jokes shall continue. All right, I think these bad boys are good enough to add all of our other stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and take this and drain this out a little bit. Hello, Lori, welcome. We're just gonna go ahead and dump it in our bacon grease bowl, which we will dispose of later. All right, so the bacon grease is done. Got some bacon. Bacon grease is gone. We're gonna go ahead and add some onions. Um, this is a huge onion that we bought. It's probably way too many onions, but the Lotto King likes a lot of onions in his soup. So, what did the doctor say? Um, I have gained 11 pounds and I have some edema in my ankles, so we're fairly certain I'm on the drug. That's what we learned. So yeah, but not a lot. I accidentally spoke to one doctor. Everybody else was just the research for the trial, but... Oh, Robert. Jason has a question for me. Okay. Go ahead, Jason. Put her to her. All right, now we are going to add some chicken broth. Um, I might add some more of this. Um, I swear the last recipe, they actually have you add some water, but we're going to do all chicken broth. Yeah, Stacy's been... Sorry, guys, my brother's calling me. He may continue to call me. Hopefully, he knows that I'm live on YouTube. I don't know if he will or not. Hopefully, hopefully he behaves himself. I forgot to block him. I did. <laughs> so... We got our bacon in there, we got our onions in there, we have our chicken broth. I'm fairly certain you let this go. How long did it take for Isla to get the money? I won $200 today. Um, do you have your um, bank account and everything verified? I had to send them a bank statement and all this other crap. So make sure you pay attention to your iLottery um, thing and it'll tell you. And then mine wasn't long after that, but. All right, hold on, I gotta read my recipe again. I forget if I put the potatoes. We gotta add the potatoes, but I think we're gonna need some water because I don't know if this is gonna be enough. These are our, these are our little baby Yukon Golds. I think I may add a little bit more water, not so much chicken broth. I mean, the chicken broth is gonna make it amazing, but I think I need some water. And you know what? For good measure, let's add some chicken broth. A little longer. <laughs> Not yet, Robert. Not until I have to wear a brassiere. That's next. Um, try refreshing. My brother called me and it might refresh it, but yeah. There's too much power. Uh oh. Am I connected to Wi-Fi? Is everyone else okay? Was it okay before? I think my connection should be okay. I'm gonna get my brother called me, so if you refresh, it might make you a little better. All right. So now this bad boy technically needs covered, and as you all know, I still need a new lid. Uh oh. I gotta put a filter on it. That's no good. We're gonna go ahead and just cover that up a little bit. The connection's fine, okay. It was probably because I was probably just when my brother called me. So, now for the recipe, we need to do some flour and a milk, uh, milk mess. Um, let me go over here to my recipe. I forget how much milk I actually need. Three cups, three cups, three tablespoons of flour. Three cups, three tablespoons of flour. 
right. It's been three cups. Well, that's a lot of milk, guys. I think I can only do two cups in here. So. I think we're going to do it in a bowl. Hello, Belinda. How are you doing? Did Is Penny done cooking yet? I was watching Penny. Oh, that's cool, Robert. You need a bigger bowl? I do, Mom. I need a new lid. I only have a freaking pizza pan. <laughs> because the other one shattered. Ah, oh, no. Yeah, to do the milk. Ah, shit. Put that on. That's good. It's good. <laughs> I need three cups. This is the one from Taste a Whole Mom. I haven't made this in a while, but all right. We're going to do three... Christmas is coming, I know. Hey, I have a P.O. box. Someone's allowed to send me some cheap dishware from Dollar General. I haven't got there yet, but. Okay, so we're gonna do, gonna do three. Oh, shit. I'm getting stuff all over the place. All right, let's go over here. I got milk all over the place, all right. This seems like more milk than before, but I guess more milk the better. Let me clean up my milk mess over here, everybody. We don't want sour milk on the floor on my cabinets. So that's no good. Okay. We need to add some flour in there too. Okay, we're gonna go to put our milk away. Let's go ahead and add some flour. Flour. Ollie, we got milk. We gotta get some cookies. All right, so we get over here. We're gonna go ahead and add some flour. I gotta see if I have any measures. So let's add six of these babies. Set that bowl on a flat surface. Yeah, that's good. We'll put it on the burner. I have too much shit on my countertops. <laughs> All right. We're going to go ahead and add six because these are half tablespoons. We're, you know, we're going to add big ones. That's two. That's three. <laughs> He doesn't listen to us. Hey, I'm a trained professional over here. That seems like more milk than I've ever used before. I think I have too much in the bowl now because I added extra water. Okay, so that's going to go there. Now, guys, I don't have a whisk. So I'm just going to have... Let me see what I got over here. Actually, I might. Uh, let me see what's in my bag of tricks now. Let's just use this wooden spoon that's ancient. Ooh, Christmas cookie. We've been waiting. We've been waiting. I don't eat raw chicken. That chicken was cooked. <laughs> hey, what's up, PA Redneck? We're making potato soup. Our potato mixture is currently coming to a close. We have been, Stacy. We've been asking all the chicks, like, where are our Christmas tickets? Our Christmas tickets. Use a fork. No, we're gonna use the spoon. It'll be fine. Maybe. I don't wanna overflow it. Because every time I do this mixture, it always ends up being ultra up. You get a little rivels in your potato soup. Absolutely. Whisk mixing bowl. Yes, there's my Amazon wish list. I need new cookware and whisk mixing bowls. Yes. You know, I should buy some. I mean, I make super chats from these, so I'm a I'm rude for not improving my um, set here. Yeah, Robert gave me new dishes. Robert, you need to go shopping again. <laughs> it's good. That's okay. It makes it like rivels, potatoes and rivel soup. <sighs> Such a time. No, no, I'm using, I'm using my, I already dirtied this, we're not using a fork. They're already starting to get good, so we're fine. We have like a $400 blender over here that Carl doesn't use. I could put it in there, but I don't dare use that because it's like, it's like super, I don't know why he doesn't sell it on eBay or something. It's snowing. It is raining here, I think, and crappy. But the... Yeah. <laughs> so I got stuff going on tomorrow, so I don't know. See, my problem, guys, is this. I'm out of lottery videos, so I either need to do it next Saturday or I need to do it tomorrow. 
it's just cookie Jones just needs to be running hot lottery tickets. I know, it does sound perfectly familiar. Mom, can you call my brother and tell him that I'm live streaming and to stop calling me? That would be great. That's the second time he's done that. And I didn't tell him and I didn't block him, so. I know, my brother's calling me for the second time, which means he'll call me about eight more times while I'm live streaming. <sighs> Shame on it. Or send him a text message and say, Kenny's live streaming. Stop. Stop calling me. That's got it. All right. Thank you. Thanks so much. I appreciate it. You know, the talent needs protection. What were we talking about? Oh, yeah. Oh, Jess, I've got a question for you. So you got that $30 ticket we're going to do tonight. Hello, we are making potato soup. So, Jess, what $30 ticket do you want? Do you want the new one or do you want a mega? Yeah, but I can't do airplane mode because then the data doesn't work and I can't live stream. I don't. Well, actually, I probably can because it's on Wi-Fi. You know what? You are right, Belinda. I've never. Well, I can't do it when I'm out when I'm not on Wi-Fi because then it wouldn't work. But yeah. See, guys, it's not lumpy. How's our potatoes going? Actually, let's let's crank that bad boy up because we need to get that to a boil. Gambler's choice. Oh, Jess. Thirty dollars would buy a lot of us. We need the cheap ones. My original cookware that I have was from Amazon from like 2011. So, but they're still holding strong here. And half of this stuff is my mom's anyway. I think this bowl was my mom's. Um, this spoon was mom's. Mom gave me a lot of cookware when I moved. So, <sighs> see guys, there's no flour in there anymore. Nice little soft mix. The milk was lumpy. It was fresh when we bought it. I think it's good. I don't smell, it smell weird. Yeah, we're gonna go to the Dollar Tree. We go to Dollar General. Dollar General has good cookware. I bought mine from Amazon. Yeah, they were really cheap to begin with. I know, you want a shopping hall at the Dollar General. If I ever go cooking, cookware shopping, I will go to the Dollar General. I can't do it today. I've got a lot of stuff going on, but. I did a great job on the slurry. What's the slurry? Mm -mm -mm. Stoneware. <laughs> oh, Robert, Robert. All right. So basically, we want our potato soup to come to a boil. Um, this is the uh, flour and milk mixture, which we're going to throw in once everything comes to a boil. Um, yeah, this is going to go in there. We've got a cube of cheddar cheese. This is sharp cheddar. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, oh, you want like a coupon on the coupon channel. I gotcha. Yeah, I've done stuff from there before, but again... Hmm. With doing, if I was only doing Coupon King, it would be fine. But I'm doing Lotto King too at the same time, and it takes up it takes up a decent amount of my time. So, oh, it's called a slurry, is it? I never heard of that in my life. But the hell, now we know we got some slurry going over here, folks. You know what? I'm gonna eat a piece of cheese because I can. Let's taste the cheese before we get, while we wait. Hi everybody, let's taste the cheese. Hmm. Oh, a row. It's kind of like a row. The cheese is good. Hello, Christy Turner. What the heck is that? It's a row. This currently here is flour and um, milk. That's it. It's going to go into our potato soup, which is currently getting to a boil. Once it gets into a boil, we're going to add some more stuff to it. It's going to be great. I have to quit Lotto King to be able to put more time over there, but... Hello, John Boy. Hello, Christy. Yeah. So, like a row. It's like a row. I mean, we're getting all cooking channel over here and shit. And... How are we going? So, that's almost coming to a boil. Not yet. So, we're getting on that. We got that going on. Let's go over here and check out Ollie. How about. Cooking. I could be the cook king. Ollie, how you doing, bro? Ollie's like, I'm tired and cold, everybody. It's cold in here. It is cold in here. 
All these like this, yeah. There you go. Now you can't get out anymore. All right. All right. As a good cook, I will not wash my hands, even though I'm not touching anything else. But we don't want to touch the cat and then continue to cook. Where's the bacon? Um, it's already in the pan. That is currently coming to a boil. We did the bacon first. We did a combo with an air fry. Is it a roux, Ida? A roux? Is it a roux or what are we doing here? A roux. Start cooking. Everybody's cooking now. Cody was cooking. We got um, well, Wicked Penny. She was just cooking. I was watching her. She was making a flatbread. So, yeah. So we want to get this bad boy to a boil, but I think it is to a boil. It's slowly but surely. But there are our main potatoes. We got our potatoes. We got our bacon. We've got our onions. We've got. Oh, it looks so good. It's gonna be good. I know this is a lot of okay gourmet. So that is basically coming to a boil. Let me consult my recipe real quick over here. I had it printed out, but I forgot. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, guys. If you get whiplash, that's why we're a limited liability company here. Whiplash not. See, that says you gotta come to a boil, but I'm concerned about the potatoes. Those potatoes gotta come down, but because then it wants you to put the milk in, and then you bring that to a boil, and then once that's to a boil, she wants cups. She's been hurt. I'm gonna eat more cheese. I gotta start eating the cheese here. I stick it in there. We're making potato soup. It's the best ever potato soup, according to Taste of Home magazine. This is an old recipe. Huh. It's coming to a boil, so we're gonna go ahead and now add a row or slurry, whatever we wanna call it. We are gonna have a small bowl of it to taste test it when we're done, because Kenny's kinda hungry. Slow, nah, just, that bitch just goes in there, and then we mix it. <laughs> okay then, see that bitch just goes in there, look at it. The only thing we have not added is our seasonings. We gotta get some salt and pepper up in here, yo. We have not salt and peppered it. Kenny is hungry. I'm f freaking 11 pounds heavier now, so Kenny needs to eat. Yeah, Tab, we're making potato soup. We're gonna put some pepper in here. Some more pepper. I don't know if we need a lot of salt because there's a lot of salt in that. Um... Ooh, we can add poppy seeds, yo. You remember we got these poppy seeds when we made our sandwiches? These things are like five dollars. We're putting some in here just because I can't. Give it a, some more. Um, it'll give it a more black, even though they do nothing except you can eat it. You want salt? I'm afraid it's gonna be too salty. We got already got all that chicken broth in there, but we'll put some salt in there. This will be fine. All right, let's mix her up again. Now, we gotta bring, look at it, it's starting to come together and looking pretty. The best part is, is when you add the cheese to it and then it gets a little cheddar. Oh, look how good that bacon looks. Hey, show, we're making best ever potato soup. Taste it. All right, well, let's do a little tasty, tasty. Mm. Mm. <laughs> parsley. I do have parsley. We need to put some of that in there. Mmm. Some dill. The cheese is probably not salty though, because it's just a um, sharp cheddar. Yeah, it needs boiled to thicken. You boil it to thicken and make sure all the potatoes are done, and then you put the cheese in at the end. And well, according to the recipe, you're supposed to put that in first. But mmm, cream cheese to thicken. That's not, see, I have a crock pot. I got a crock pot from the Secret Santa last year, but I've only used it like one time. Because, wow, now that you cooking with the Lotto King, crock pot, I could do crock pot recipes with the Lotto King, I suppose. You just wouldn't get to see the final product, but. 
All right, sounds good, Jess. See you six o'clock thereafter. Everybody, and I'm saying this to every 24 people that are watching, if you want to watch tonight's live stream, set an alarm. I will be live. YouTube is probably not going to give you a notification, so don't come into the stream and say, I didn't get a notification. This is your notification. Is there bacon in there? Yes, there is. There is bacon in there, Tab. It's applewood smoked. It's partially air fried and then finished in the pan. I know. I do. I need to use my crock pot more. I'm sh but, you know, I'm using my crock pot because I want to make some of that freaking Christmas Chex mix where you add the Worcestershire sauce. It was so yeah, there's apple smoked bacon in there. It was half air fried. When you add the cheese to this, baby, this is the best potato. They call it the best potato soup pepper, so I stand by it. We are using Swanson chicken broth, everybody. Not that I got to get the brands in there, but. All right, we're going to go ahead and put this in the fridge. Ollie, what are we going to make with that? Uh. So our goal is, is to make something tomorrow with that. Ooh, we got crock, crock pot recipes with a lot of cooking. Yeah, that Chex Mix is amazeballs. You bring cookies, Stacy, and if I make Chex Mix, I will bring you a bag of it whenever I make it. I might do it next weekend. Ooh, a roast. All right, so this baby needs to come up to a boil. We're just going to cover that. Ooh, green onions. I forgot the green onions. I was going to get green onions, Ida, but time-wise, I'm like, we don't have time for green onions. Let's just go ahead and let that thicken a little smidge in. I need to clean my lottery table, so let's clean the lottery table so we get ready for tonight. I want to show you guys. <laughs> the poor lottery table has so much stuff in it. And Texan Candy sent me this awesome scratcher. I'm going to try to use it out tonight. Um, I got one of these Wheel of Fortune scratchers. I'm gonna try it. This is my new um, thing that I connect my internet to, which is supposed to make the stream better. We've got a hat over here. This candle I got at Hollywood Casino like eight years ago, and it's still here, and I don't know why. I mean, we've got a fireball that no one's using. Got my J scratcher coin. This is from the book. Uh, yeah, no, it'll be fine. We'll, I'll go back here and watch in a second. We got some more losing lottery tickets. That goes over here, you know. I already put parsley in it. We got some parsley in there. Don't forget the balls, everybody. We have balls. We haven't played with our balls in the channel in a while. But I just got random, like, fan mail things that I've already been done. Whose is this? Oh, that's Sherry. He's already sent hers back. I'm sorry, Cream. So, yeah, this is the messy scratcher station. <laughs> it's where all the magic happens on a Saturday night, but... Woo, Bitcoin's coming up and lot hey, all mods, low rollers allowed to talk about Bitcoin because I am not gambling, so do not time him out. He's good. I have not. Last time I checked, it went up a little bit, low roller, but nothing crazy. All right, let's check. We don't, again, we don't want this thing to freaking overdo it. I gotta do dishes, guys, after this. My apartment is such a train wreck. I have to clean my bathroom. I'm supposed to be doing work today. I have to put in four hours this weekend to get my salary without taking over without taking vacation time. Ooh, it's bubbling. Oh, it's bubbling. Let me remind you, I used a lot of onions. Look at all those onions. This is an onion party. Oh, guys, this is amazing. This is such a good soup. Good soup for a cold winter day. Only here on the Lotto King channel do you get to see amazing things like this. We're going to tr try a potato. Because I'm afraid the potatoes aren't done. I'm afraid we did that too quick. And we might have to let this bad boy simmer a little bit longer. All right. See you, Ida. Thank you for popping in. Good luck. Have fun. I got to clean the shitter. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Oh, hi. Ooh, potatoes hot. Oh, yeah. Uh. The potatoes hot. But it's not in that. So it's too much. It's hot. Did I hear about the earthquake in Alaska? No, I did not. You know, George Bush died too. There's so much happening. I don't think it's the new world order now. 
We're gonna go ahead and just let that simmer on low for a little bit till we add the cheese in. It's not quite done, the potatoes are a little tough yet, so I'm just gonna let it simmer for a minute or two, and then we're gonna pour ourselves a bowl and we're gonna have it and test taste it. It's gonna be great. I don't know, Lola, we don't do politics here, and that's as far as we're gonna speak about that or anything like that, we don't do politics. Yeah. It's talking about yeah. Ollie, what's up, brother? You gotta wake you guys. You gotta wake up, but this is Ollie's life. Ollie's like it's cold in here, guys. Say let's go in with Ollie. Ollie's like it's cold in here, guys. Ollie, is it cold? He's like it's cold in here. Hey, my dryer's actually done, so I've got hot clothes. If you wait a little bit when we're done, I don't know. And Ollie's like now my my blanket went across. Oh no, let's get you back over there. You gotta get covered up. It's cold in here. All he's like, it's cold in here, man. Just put it over your head. Now you're good to go. <laughs> oh, all right. So, yeah, this is only going to be a couple of minutes. I actually have the heat turned down, but um, it's okay. Oh. Stir, keep this stirred. We don't want the milk. You're not supposed to really cook it so much. Yeah, all he's like, he'll sit there in that thing all afternoon. I probably should have cut up the potatoes a smidgen more, but that's okay. I think we are gonna add more parsley. As Stacy said, I have more parsley. We'll put parsley in for a little bit more mix. What is the meat? It is applewood smoked bacon, which I half air fried and half pan fried because I ran out of time on my meal prepping or all my ingredient prepping before I went live. So I just did the rest in the pan. Um, we did get the grease out of there. So yeah, this this whole thing blends awesome when you take the cheese, the bacon, yeah. I do, it's 62 degrees in here, Tab, but it's actually about 70 because I was doing my dryer and we take our dryer vent and we put it inside, so. Ooh, some cayenne, I don't know if I want the heat, but yeah. I mean, I don't mind a potato that's a little rough. I just want to make sure it's like not super not done. Ooh, ooh, hot. <laughs> okay, guys, it's time. It's time to add the cheese. Should have, but that bacon was hard. It was hot. And, and uh, I didn't have a good enough knife to chop it. So. We're going to turn the heat down. This is sharp cheddar, but um, you can use whatever cheese you do desire. This does give it a nice and yummy. Um, ooh, you need ham and cheese too. That sounds good. I had my omelet earlier, so this is gonna be my snack. I'm gonna get done with this. I'm gonna do all the dishes, get it cleaned up. I gotta go clean my bathroom. And then I think I'm gonna go out, buy my pizza, buy tickets for tonight, stop at the liquor store. Ooh, we got just a warming soup. And then I'm gonna come home. I'm going to eat a piece of pizza. I'm going to film my Saturday video for my other channel. I'm gonna take a shower, then I'm gonna chill. Then I might log into work for a little while. And then by that time, it'll be time to get ready for the stream. So I gotta go get coffee. So, yeah, okay, that's done. My Saturday's booked. My Sunday's, my Sunday's not too bad, but again, I'm meeting an old classmate. I haven't seen about five years for lunch tomorrow, so. so. But I would like to film my skill video this afternoon, too, so I don't have to do it tomorrow since I'm doing that, but I think we're going to fit it all in, and I'm going to get everything done, and it's going to be great. I have a feeling I'll probably be working tonight after uh, my live stream, so. But I bet you this is the busy season, I'm sure. 
Okay, you do like taking a nap. I need a nap too because I didn't get home to like 11. I was up at 7, so I only got like 8 hours of sleep. So, so yeah, this bacon probably should have been chopped, but I love just good strands of bacon in my soup. I'm weird, I know. But all right, I think now nah, there's still some cheese in there. We're gonna let the cheese go a little longer. I try to try to melt as much as possible, but it's awesome because then I put these in bowls and then I reheat them. Uh, yeah, those bacon do look hideous, Belinda, but yeah. Uh, I click buttons, Jamie. <laughs> I work for a housing company. We make modular houses. And yeah, and I've got lots of work to do, so. Going to sleep. All right, good night, Christy. Have a good sleep. Everybody's taking naps. It's not fair. When do I nap? I actually need extra salt. Okay, we'll do a quick taste test. I don't know. This could be the time, but I can add salt. Mmm. A little. Only a little. What is that? A little salt. All right. I think it's good. Done. It's done. Now we're going to have a taste test. I got to get myself a beverage. Turn that baby off. Oh, you got pain pills. Oh, that's crazy. I think I've seen that recipe before, Cheryl. I'm just trying to read it here. The Rotel tomatoes and that. That does probably amazing. I know. And I'm a lotto um, impersonator. I'm an person, a lotto impersonator. Alright, we're not going to use one of Robert's fancy bowls because I'm going to put it in this bowl because it's a high back. It's like a high one. But... Alright, let's just fix a little bit. Fix a little bowl here and we'll do a little taste tester -oo, a little snacky snacky again. Not a ton. Not a ton because I am going to go get pizza. That's <laughs> a little out. We're going to go ahead and let this. This thickens everybody as you let it sit. So we're just going to pull that bad boy over there. Let's put this over here into my messy table that needs cleaned. I've got mail and God knows what over here. I've got mail, I've got drugs. Ugh. All right, I need a beverage. I also have cheesecake in here too. All right, we'll give you some point of view, uh, point of view food eating, and then we'll flip the camera around. We'll just chit chat a little bit more. Chitty chatty, chitty chatty. Let's go through that mail. It's not exciting. I've actually already gone through it. It just needs thrown away. There's just, they want to give me credit cards and get me out of debt and all this crap. I was like, that's no fun. I like debt and credit cards, but I don't need more credit cards. Too many credit cards. Too many credit cards, I forget to pay them. <laughs> like, I guess my mom. We were at the airport yesterday, and I was paying all my bills, and I'm like, shit, I forgot Capital One. <laughs> like, <laughs> because I don't put a ton on them, a little. I usually spread them around, you know, to keep the rewards coming from every angle. And it's like, salsa on this? Um, you probably could. I know, I need an earthquake. I need an earthquake to come through my apartment. Oh, guys. Lori doesn't have any credit cards. I'll give you one. You can have one. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, you can put a little... Yeah, you can really do a variation on that. I don't, Lori. I did not know that.
Sure. I'm going to give you one that only has like a thousand dollar balance. Uh, the one, the new one that I got, they only gave me a thousand dollars. So they apparently want to see if I can handle it. So I just pay everything on it and I pay it off in full every month to make. Well, maybe they'll love me. Oh, I just love the strands of bacon. They eventually cut apart. <laughs> uh, what time tonight? Six o'clock Eastern time for tickets and then PA skills. And we'll go to the post office box, but I'm sure there's nothing there. Um, this week's videos, I did not put the post office box in it, but my new round of tickets, I'm going to be sure to put that in there just in case anyone cares about it. Oh no. Shake and bake. That's right. Guys, I'm gonna have to eat this entire chunk of bacon, which is horrible. But it's horrible. It is calm. All right, we gotta flip this over here. It'll be a little easier to eat this, so I don't need to look through there. Ah. But yeah, so best ever potato soup. You can do lots of. Um, Things with the John Lennon give you a copyright. It happens. Do you feel poor for me because I have to eat this entire thing of bacon? Mmm. Mmm. Bacon. Oh, you used to, oh, you can see it moving, everybody. It's moving. There's a cat in there. <laughs> There's a cat trying to get out, I think. All right, see you, Wesley. How do you see you tonight? Is Uber available in my area? Um, it is, but there's not many people that do it, so not really. All right, see you, Belinda. We will see you tonight, hopefully. If not, uh, have yourself a great day. Oh, he's like, I'm awake. No soup for you. But it's the best ever potato soup. It's got bacon and cheese. It's so good. Mm. Oh, so a hammer. I was trying to trigger my inner hammer. I was at Harrisburg at the airport. They have lottery. I filmed that one video when I was there, and I didn't really, but I didn't win much. But I went back about the last of the roll of Chris Kringle for 20 bucks. I ended up getting five bucks on the very last ticket, but I didn't get a Kringle. I was hoping. I should have made fries up. It's soup. I haven't had this in so long. Um, Josh wanted me to do chili, which I think I did chili already on this, but. Ollie, are you going back to sleep? Ollie's like, yeah, I'm tired. You like best? If I <laughs> it probably is, but it's, it's so sad. I'm gonna get them all tonight. And hopefully I can get every $5 ticket that's out that I get my hands on, but. Mmm. That's right, Pierre Rennick, it's so good. It's so good on cold Pennsylvania day. Are you asking me what? I'm doing good, I'm busy, I'm uh, busy. Again, I flew home last night. I got home here about like 10.30. I went to bed by 11. I was up at seven, went for my parents for breakfast. Um, and um, yeah, then I got home. I finished. I still have a load of lottery to finish. I need to clean up all these dishes. <sighs> I gotta get pizza. I gotta get lottery tickets. I know they are hammer, but I won seventy-five bucks. That made me happy. But I am having the best ever potato soup. Random mushrooms and make a soup. There we go. It is already December. It is. So I got a busy afternoon. And then I have to call my brother back because if he kept calling me as I told my dad or my mom, I'm like, can you please let him know I'm live streaming? Stop calling me. Mm-hmm. Hello, Benjamin Asbury. How are you? 19 days till mom's birthday. Happy early birthday. Mmm. 
So I approve of the soup. It's pretty good. Best ever potato soup. Me, best ever potato soup. Did I get good news for Boston? Um, I guess. Again, I. They said I gained 11 pounds since I started the drug, and um, I'm getting some slight edema in my ankles, which is a good sign because that pretty much means I'm probably on the actual drug. So, yeah, Ollie's over there. We were just over there saying hi to him. But other than that, I just talked to one doctor. Everything else was for the trial research. Not a lot. Um, I go back in January, which you have to be hooked up to an IV for seven hours to get blood draw, but... I hope Kenny eating you soup is turning you on. You have to, if you didn't watch me making it, you have to go back and watch it. It was amazing. Mmm. The sizzling bacon. It's like food porn. Mmm. But, yeah, so Lotto King is fat. Oh, that's a crazy one. Lotto King's fat now, so you're allowed to make fat jokes about the Lotto King. Mainly in my ankles, I do feel like I got water weight in my gut. I feel like I'm soon gonna need new pants, but. <laughs> mm. uh, no, the weight is normal. It's pretty much just water weight. They're not mad. They pretty much it gives a sign and a signal that the drug that they gave me is actually the actual drug. So they're kind of happy about that because obviously they want as many people on. The drug, not the placebo, so, but, you should get out there, hi baby. Oh, that's weird one, I don't know, YouTube's weird like that. But, yeah, so they were, but what happens is, is if I gain too much weight, they're going to cut the drug back a little bit, so. Yeah, pretty much, I mean, I think the drug is working, so. So we kind of um, talked to the, um, hey, what's up, Christian Alberti? How are you, sir? I still have not gotten to state college. We got to plan something. It's been, life's been crazy around here lately, but. So they told me, so pretty much the drug, like I originally thought like it was going to make, my, see, I have a high number of long chain fatty acids on my spinal cord, which is kind of eat me away. Um, so what they said is the drug doesn't reduce that, but it's supposed to take the toxicity, um, the toxicity from that, which is supposed to stop the, what it's doing, so it's just good. Uh, yes, it's a two-thirds get the drug, one-third get the um, placebo. Um, it, it's The doctors don't know, only the drug company. Um, so, yeah, so they don't even know, but I have this weekend and next weekend. Then I'm home for break. Oh, that's right. <sighs> next weekend, I don't know, Christian. This weekend, I hell no, I can't, but... Uh, we'll see. If not, I'll get you when you get back from break. Maybe. January, bah, January's freaking crazy. I've got January, February. Well, January's not too bad. But the one week I have a work conference, Thursday and a Friday. The week after that, I go to Boston for three days. The week after that, then I'm going to Vegas with Sufac for the weekend again for super awesome food. And then February, I think, is good. December, though, is amazing. I don't have much going on in December. Kind of, Laura. Yeah, it's a, that's just their way. But I don't, it's weird, but. So, but again, the drug company sends it. And I know, then we got a drug, a pull at, well, he can send, as long as that's a Saturday, I should be able to do it, but. You poor, poor, poor Christian, but it's doing well. You planted a lottery ticket, so you're behaving. Hammer just said you gotta play Kringles, the best out there. Make sure you tune in for $5 Friday. Neon. Yeah, it's exciting. I mean, it's cool. It's pretty cool. Seems pretty good, everybody. And for in about 45 minutes, I'm gonna go to go to the liquor store and get some wine and pizza. So you keep picturing myself winning big. Well, I hope so. You played New York as PA has been very salty, but is New York any better? Poor PA lottery, we try.
Hmm. Oh, hey, that's all that matters. Mmm. Would it be rude of me to put the rest of the bowl up to my mouth and just slurp it all in? Is that rude on YouTube? I don't know. They should be better, Christian. They should. Or do I have to... No. It's not rude. I'm allowed to do that. <laughs> I'd be very happy. Use pinks. So if I do this... You didn't even see it. It went so quick. And now the soup's done. How's it going, Charlie? How's San Antonio? Soup shots. <laughs> we did it. Hey, what's up, Tony Martinez? Woo! All right. Well, we made the best ever potato soup if you just got here. Are you good at calculating taxes? Not really, no, but. Ooh, what the? Oh my god. Belinda's making penises. Wow. It's warm. It's not bad here. It's actually above freezing. It's just kind of rainy and overcast. I think it's supposed to rain more later. I have a feeling our Saturday live tonight is going to be in the rain from the looks of it, but... Yeah. Yeah, mid that's what I'm about. But I think we're supposed to get rain later, um, Christian. I think it's coming from Ohio in this way, so... Today and tomorrow is supposed to be meh, meh. But anyway, everybody. Yeah, I think, let me look at the radar. I think it's coming. I think it's coming, where is it? I figured if it's coming, it'd be to you by now, but we'll see. Ugh, I gotta shave. I haven't shaved in like eight years. I feel so scruffy and blah. I haven't taken a shower in like a day and a half either. I'm due. You had 101 subs, woo! So the rain's currently in Ohio. It's then there's a band in Maryland, so it's probably all gonna come up and like, psh, which it's probably gonna get to you first. But at least it's rain. That's good. Super good. <sighs> so yeah, I'm gonna go. I gotta go do dishes up and be responsible and not leave this mess here. You should see my cybers and I get a girl looking like Scruffy. Hey, I used to have, if you look some pictures out there, I used to have freaking mutton chops, like freaking just sideburns. I, I, I had the whole thing going on. Did I get a girl? No, but the chicks digged it. The hair between their legs. <laughs> it tickles. All he's cleaning it up, he's taking care of business, Ben. Fear not. But. Do I, do I have soup on my glasses? I do. <laughs> That's probably from slurping it. So, I'm gonna let you all go. Thank you for tuning in with Cooking with the Lotto King. I would call it a success. 50 minutes in, done, done, done. I'm gonna go clean all of this up. I'm gonna go to the liquor store. I need some wine. I gotta go eat some pizza. I know, Ollie's currently cleaning his primary. Do you wanna go over and say hi to Ollie before we leave? Um, then, lottery tickets, and, oh my gosh, pizza, get drunk on wine, make a video for my other channel. It's going to be a good time. Ollie, you can't lick the blanket now, brother. What are you doing? I wish I had that. Ollie, Ollie's licking the blanket. What's on the blanket, dude? You're weird. Yeah, definitely. You have to go to uh, Taste of Home if you want the actual recipe. Now he's licking. He's like, ooh, there's potato soup on here, guys. Yeah, the rain's on by Pittsburgh, which means that it's on its way. I get drunk on wine. It only takes one. It's funny. With my disease, it gets really weird. Ollie's over here licking the blanket. Ollie, you're weird. He's like, you a-hole. He's like, I'm trying to take a bath. <laughs> oh, ow. He's like, there's potato soup on here, guys. <laughs> you're weird. Ollie, you're weird. Let's go say hi to Kit, too, before we go. Uh, we'll go say hi to Kit. Hey, what's up, Ming? You miss me cooking, Ming? Unless you've been here the whole time. 
Hello. This isn't what I meant to see. I'm sorry. Oh, that's right. I gotta put my laundry away too, guys. I'm so busy. The Lana King's so busy. You're waiting on Richard Kelly and Baby Doll. Nice. All right, let's go back here. Let's go over the dryer vent. That's how we stay warm here. Don't look at the dirty floor. I've yet to sweep yet. Oh, Kit's back here bathing too. Kit's like, it's, everyone's bathing. Ollie's out there bathing. You're bathing. He's like, don't look at me like this. If Ollie was human, he'd eat me by now. Kit. Yeah. Yo, he's like, do my belly, Kenny. Do my belly. He's like, this is the life, guys. It's warm in here. Carl's got the heater on. I would, Robert, I would. He's like, oh, don't stop, kid. You don't stop. He's like, this is amazing. Like, Ming Hong says, kid needs a diet. Aww. Wow. Lori just said you're chubby. Now all the kids getting fat shamed on YouTube. Kid's like, damn it. He's like, get out of here. He's like, he's like, get out of here. Oh, he is pretty, pretty. Let's pick the tickets. No, when I go buy lottery tickets for tonight, you don't get to pick the tickets, but fear not, I'm getting lots of tickets. Uh, that's gonna end up being later today. I've got a lot to do here. Oh my God, I'm gonna fall. Say Ollie, oh my God, we're gonna fall. Uh, what about Ollie? Is Ollie a good gentleman? Ollie's like, I'm kind of fat too. You are fat. You and Kit eat the same thing, but Kit usually eats all your food, so. Ollie's like, what are, are we cleaning the crotch at the moment? He's like, yeah, I'm getting down. <laughs> oh, Ollie, I love you. But we gotta go, Ollie. We're running, time's a vasting, everybody. Time is a vasting. Let Ollie pick the tickets, yeah, I know. You can take Kit, Ollie, to Puffs, but I don't know if we're gonna buy our tickets from Puffs, because everyone hates Puffs, but. So. Okay. No, you can't pick a ticket. No one picks the tickets. But fear not, I buy a lot of tickets. Lots of $5 tickets because you guys know that you love them. So, I gotta let you all go. I gotta call my brother. He might want if you're really good. So, I will see you all tonight at 6 o'clock Eastern if you want to watch some tickets. I know it's almost 1 o'clock. I gotta get my booty moving. 6 o'clock Eastern if you want to see some tickets. MPA skill play. Saturday Night Live. So... Get some oldie tickets in the liquor store. Unfortunately, my liquor store doesn't have tickets. So it's the next town over and I'm not going down there. I've already been down there today, but I'll see what I can find. So, All right, everybody. Thanks so much for tuning in to Cooking with the Lotto King. And yeah, I'll see you all tonight. And Domino's is coming up too. I got to squeeze that out of there too, Ming. I'm very busy. So until then, bye everybody. Bloop.